Well, Josh, welcome back to Bristol Flyers. How does it feel to be back for another season with the club? Yeah, um, really, really exciting um, to be able to build on the sort of the positive aspects of last year and kind of keep progressing the, the club's journey. Um, it's, uh, yeah, just very excited to start. Yeah, it was such a whirlwind last season in terms of uh, the, the ups and downs of the season. How do you look back on it? Yeah, I mean, obviously it was it was cut short, so we'll never really know how how it was gonna gonna get to finish. But um, building into next year, we definitely need to sort of work on being more consistent and um, and kind of being able to take the positive sides of last year and do that on a more regular basis without fluctuating. Um, but then saying that, I mean even something you like the cup final like to be from where we started to all of a sudden in the NEC um in front of 9000 people and all the flyers fans in red um that's just like a crazy it's crazy that we even got to this point you know and it kind of gave us all a taste of um that you know we didn't we obviously didn't win the cup so that's the that's just the taste of where we need to be getting regularly you know um, but yeah, I mean, it, it was a huge season and a lot to build on, you know, and it really gave us the sort of belief that those are the sort of heights we should be reaching and that the fans deserve to be able to see us on, on that stage um, on, on a more and more regular basis and, and winning these trophies. You talk about that um, BBL Cup final experience. How do you think that will strengthen the team going into next season? Yeah, well, I think the, the fact that we've already got players coming back and we, we, we've got a core coming back um, that have experienced that, um, I think that's going to be huge and because I think, like I say, it gives us the belief that we know we are supposed to be on that stage, but also gives us the motivation that we didn't finish the job and now we've got to do that and finish the job. So there's a good amount of us here that understand what it's going to take in terms of culture and practice habits and keeping each other accountable um, and working hard all the time. And we now know what it takes to get there and we just need to push on over the top. So it's a huge experience, huge moment for the players, the fans, and now everyone's tasted it. You know, we, we know what we need to do to, to go and get over that hill. And how's your lockdown been? Have you been speaking to Coach Kapoulos much during this period? Yeah, yeah, we've been in, in uh, regular contact having um, kind of film session reviews on, on Zoom. So that was both like watching my my own footage from last year and the team's footage and sort of really getting the time to go in depth into, into sort of things, little tweaks that would make us more effective. Um, and also watching um, footage of other players like EuroLeague players and NBA players um, and seeing ways that, um, that they're able to, you know, to, to, to gain advantages and whatnot. So that's been really good to, to kind of actually use the time to, increase my understanding kind of learn more about the game and also just keeping in touch with with Andreas um and sort of discussing like what's required for me next year what our goals are um and kind of just keeping in the loop and keeping connected to the club while obviously everyone was isolated and locked down so that was really good just finally it's been so long without flyers basketball what's your message to the fans and the sponsors and the volunteers that have waited so long for for flyers basketball to come back um just that um you know obviously this has been a kind of very unstable very unsure time for everyone um but that you know however long it takes we will be back um and i think it's going to be i think maybe in these times i think everyone's sort of seen the value of community and the value of um everyone being together and that's basically that's what that's what that's what flyers is you know it's it's, it's the community and i think once we're once we're sort of past this or, or, or return to a new normal, so to speak, like it will be a really amazing feeling to get the community back together once again. And, and we're going to need the fans just as much as we ever did. And we'll be there working and uh, improving ourselves so that when the time's back, then we'll, we'll be ready to perform and, and sort of try and provide those experiences like the cup final and, winning games and exciting games for the fans again because I know everyone's um, been missing it and everyone needs a, something a bit positive at the moment. So, yeah.